Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm a rescue dog living my best life in Long Beach. And it's my job to help my neighborhood friends. Here's a good question. What is leash safety? Every time I see a leash, I know it's time for a walk. I have to wear one, but I don't know why. I'm just a pug, so here to help me understand are our friends at Animal Care Services. Thanks, Charlie. That's a great question. My name is Christopher Hawks, Behavior Enrichment and Transfer Coordinator with Long Beach Animal Care Services. And leashing your dog while in public is not only safe for your pet, but it's the law under Municipal Code 616100. And here's why. A lot of incidents can occur if your dog is not leashed. It could be something as simple as it running away, getting loose, and you have to come to the shelter to redeem your animal. It could be something more severe where it unfortunately gets hit by a car, or even worse, it may get an altercation with another animal that might be also off leash or uh, wildlife like coyote. In the city in Long Beach, we try really hard to enforce and educate the public regarding leash safety and having your animal on leash at all times when in a public setting. Having your dog off leash in a public setting is allowed in a designated area such as a dog park where it clearly states that off leash dogs are permitted, but it's only going to be in an area where it's specifically designated that an animal is allowed off leash. What type of pet leash should I buy? When trying to get the proper leash for your dog, it really depends upon their size and weight as well as what type of walking issues you might be experiencing when out in public. The standard one would be your six foot clip-in leash. That would be one that goes clips right into a dog's collar. And then you also have ones like a slip lead, like the one our big guy Crusher is wearing right now, that actually goes around their neck and provides a little more correction and durability when they're out on a walk. And then you also have your harnesses or spring leashes that have a little more of a give to them. Your six foot long is the maximum length you could have your dog on while it's out on a walk in public. In terms of leashing tools and accessories on the market, you'll find a large assortment available. The biggest thing is to make sure it's something that's gonna be both safe and comfortable for your pet while out on a walk. The biggest thing is to make sure that it's gonna be something that's gonna be safe for your dog and feel free to have fun. What are some tips and tricks? A lot of pet owners might deal with a common situation like pulling when their dog is on a leash. Sometimes that's why they might be apprehensive to even have the dog on the leash. But again, an easy way to counteract that would be through positive reinforcement. The easy way to do that is if your dog starts pulling to abruptly stop. And then you can do something as simple as calling his name so they recall back to you. And then once that happens, you would then mark and reward it. By that, I mean you could mark if you have a clicker or a verbal command such as yes, and then reward them with that treat for coming right back to you and you can continue your walk. Where can I find more information? For more information on leash safety, leash etiquette, and basic tips and tricks, you go to our website, longbeach.gov forward slash ACS. Just click on the resources tab and you'll find a lot of helpful information there to help you and your pet be safe while out in public on a walk. Back to you, Charlie. I personally love my black leash and orange harness. I feel like the cool kid on the block. That was great information, but now it's time for my walk. See you next time.